Hello everyone, my name is George and in this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to create Mr. Beast style YouTube shorts but completely automated. So let's get right into it. So you can see right here I'm in Final Cut Pro and this is the clip that I would like to add the captions and also track my face. So this is exactly what we're going to do. First thing is you will need to get this application right here. It's called Captionator for Final Cut. It costs $19.99. All right, so once you have this, what do you wanna do is you wanna disable the music and you wanna just keep the clip. Then you go to export right here and you click captionator. Once you click captionator, you're going to click next and then you're gonna give Final Cut Pro time to render the clip, okay? And this is by the way where the magic happens. So take a look at this. You can see it's processing and now it's going to give us an option to choose what kind of style captions we actually want so it's done everything for us you can see right here i'm going to choose the style to finzar and i'm going to click generate so let's give this a second i'm going to choose where i want this and i'm going to choose podcast 5 this is the library that i'm editing this all in so i'm going to replace this because i've had some previous ones and you can see that now i have captions so i'm going to double click on the captions i'm going to copy them I'm gonna go back and I'm going to paste the captions right here. So you can see that now I have everything, all the captions here. Let's take a look. Wait a second, I've been doing this whole thing for the past two years. My you can see that this only took me like what, 30 seconds? And I have all the captions here for the whole clip, which is 26 seconds. And if I would be doing this manually, this would have taken me over half an hour so that's pretty cool now what we can do is we can select all of them drag to the bottom right here i'm gonna drag this to a little bit out of my face right about there and now the second thing we want to do is we want to track my face so the video kind of moves with my face right it just gives it more dynamic feel to it so first what you want to do is if you have them separate you want to choose all the clips and you want to click new compound clip, right? Just so we don't have to do it all the time. We'd have just have one compound clip. All right, great. Now I'm going to drag this color board onto my face like this. And you can see that it's going to give us this face recognition. So once I've dragged it, I'm going to click analyze. And now final cut is actually going to analyze the whole clip and creates um, trackers right for my face so it's going to basically track my whole face throughout the whole clip and this is the first step in getting that kind of locked in motion as you see on TikTok and on shorts where the face is locked in the middle and the whole clips moves it moves around it so crazy stuff and I just figured this out so I wanted to share it with you guys all right so now we've done this we're just gonna click done so the next thing what we want to do is we want to, I'm gonna just turn off the sound here so it's not bothering us. So the next thing that I'm going to do is I'm actually going to choose this uh, clip and I'm going to scale it to minus 100. All right, so we're gonna flip it upside down. Now I'm going to copy paste this clip. Okay, I'm gonna drag it on top of the previous one. I'm going to select transform on this clip. I'm going to press this uh, down arrow here and I'm going to add tracker face track. Okay, so this is the one we had here. All right, and we're going, and we're going to click done. Then we are going to set this rotation to zero if you have it at any other parameter. And then I'm also going to click right here and I'm going to disable rotation. Okay, so now it should be uh, as we need it. So let's take a look. Yeah, you can see that it's tracking my face no matter where it is. But you can see that there is some black here on top right there. So in order to hide that, what I'm going to do is I can just play around with the scale. I'm just going to enlarge it and then maybe drag it a bit to the right. So now... I'm more kind of in the middle, right? You can see that the face is tracked, it's locked in, and there are captions. So let's take a look at the final results. Wait a second, 
I've been doing this whole thing for the past two years myself. I okay, so you can see that we literally spent like a couple of minutes creating this YouTube short. And now if I just add the music and I can, that's it, you know, it's done. The captions are done. The face lock is done. Now all you can do is just maybe add some B-roll and you have a great short in just two minutes. And this used to take me like an hour to make, right? 